bottles in a bucket full of ice. Yeah. Better make room, room, hit a Lambo. Celebrate. Bitch, better believe that I'm a sniper. Yeah. You know I'm about to take you from your man, don't celebrate. And then we walk in and a scab with some shooters, we jump inside of the view with you. That's what happened. There's a couple choppers, acoustic, and I get That's just absurd. Music. I'm gonna try to rap that. <laughs> While I'm driving, I'm walking in the sky with some shooters. We jump inside of the view, we keep duck inside of the movies. Chop up the cruise, they get tough when the music is. I'm loving that music, it's stuck inside of the cubics. I never love it, the truth is I'm fucking These dudes are me walking a trap like a boss. Oh, you know I'm dripping with the sauce. Oh, great song. They just go in, you know? Okay, hey guys, it's Sarah Baska, and I'm not wearing any makeup because, to be honest, I just didn't want to put any on today, and I'm trying to be more comfortable with my natural face. Yes, I got some rosacea in places, but that's what my skin is, so whatever. If you guys are like artsy and stuff, and like art, um, <laughs> that sounded like bad. If you guys like art and appreciate the beauty of artists and art and paintings, my boyfriend, he doesn't know that I'm saying this, but I think he's so talented. Like, look at this. Who, what? If you want some of his paintings or prints, go to his website and buy some because he deserves all the recognition. He's a beautiful artist. Love him! Next. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. What are you doing? I don't know if this is something that someone has already done. I don't know, maybe I can like start a YouTube trend. It's a game with a bunch of ma holy sh- There's so many mouth guards. Why are there so many? 10 mouthpieces, wow. Wow. I'm just gonna call people and try to have a conversation with this mouth guard in. I went to Target just for this game. <laughs> I told myself right before walking and I'm like, okay, just go in game section. You're out of there, because I always spend so much money at Target. I left with a Keurig, those coffee makers, a blender, so many knickknacks that I didn't really need. So yeah, Target is a dangerous place for myself. I got there at two and left around five. That's not healthy, it's not a healthy thing. First, let's dive in, let's get comfy. Oh, actually, first before that, I want you guys to pause this video, and I usually say get a snack. You can. But go get a glass of water because I know I don't drink enough because I'm like, why do I feel so fatigued and like bad right now? Because you're dehydrated, like go drink water and then when you're done chugging a glass, you feel fine. So everyone pause this and go get a cup of water, come back, don't drink it yet. We're gonna drink it together as a family. Okay, that's cute, cute. All right, Baskinators. <laughs> That reminds me of Baconators. And then I think of Wendy's. I gained so much weight in high school. Every lunch, I would go to Wendy's, just get a Baconator fries soda. And then I go home and I'm like, why am I gaining weight? You're eating Baconators every day and not even just single Baconators. I would make that double. And the speaker, they'd be like, do you want to make that a combo? And I'm just like, you know what? Yeah, I do, large. Not even just medium or small. I want large, why? I don't even finish the fries. Uh, anyway. And this is why people think I'm socially awkward. Everyone raise your glasses up and let's chug together. While some absurd music is playing in the background. I don't know what it's gonna be yet, but. Self-care, y'all. One, two, three, self-care! Um, yeah, fun. I really wanna go buy a beer bong just for water. It's like a large funnel with a really long tube. And then you fill it up with beer. And then there's like a little crank on the tube and you put it in your mouth. This is such like a college thing. But then you pull the crank, just beer flooding down. And before you know it, beer is down your throat and you didn't even realize that you let beer inside of your mouth in the first place. It's literally just like skyrocketing down your throat and then in like five seconds, you finished a whole bottle of beer. Um, and you don't even think about it. It takes a lot to like drink a whole thing of water and be committed to it, you know? So if we just like beer pong some water, shoot it down, we don't even have to think about it and we can carry on with our day. Maybe an hour later, do it again. You know how Post Malone, he has a designated beer bomb guy. I'm gonna have the same thing, but just for water because I just need to remember to drink water. But anyway, hey guys, let's dive in. I'm done ranting, holy shit. What? What was with my speaker right there? What was that? Come on, Trey. Oh, I'm about to dive in. Think about taking a couple laps. Um, okay, 
right, let's put these mouth guards in. I'm gonna call my mom first. I've never really introduced my mom on this channel, but she is something. Just so you can get a personality background on my mom, I'm gonna read you our past text messages. So my mom watched uh, Tana Mojo's music video yesterday and felt inspired to create her own rap. This is what <laughs> she came up with. Looking for a hunky grease monkey, kind of funky with that junkie in his trunky. I'm feeling a little spunky. Gotta find hunky grease monkey. First of all, what? And then she responds, it's good. And then she responds, revving up my engine like a real true legend. <laughs> First of all, Okay, so you're rapping about, I'm guessing, cars? Second of all, engine and legend don't really rhyme, but like, nice try for being extremely white. She keeps going. She's confident in her lyrics. Racing up sunset like a millennium jet set. Feeling so fly like I'm verified. <laughs> I could make a whole YouTube video on just my mom's text messages to me. Some say I slay. She doesn't spell it S-L-A-Y. She spells it slay, like Santa's slay. Some say I slay and call me baby speedway, but I like my men cayenne. Meet me at my playpen. That's Barb. That is Barb. Got my honey next to me, stepping out of the scene. Paparazzi over there, I just don't care. Bouncer sees me and gets us in for free. Champagne bottles popping. Can you see their heads bopping to that sick beat? Get off your seat and onto your feet. Sarah, what you doing? Hey. Say hi to Dad. Hi, Dad. Ooh, we're, we're in the car. What are you guys doing? What are we doing? Yeah. Driving over to a store to look at furniture and stuff. That's how you hurt What? That's how you hurt Are you going to that? <laughs> <laughs> you cracked me up. Are you okay? I'm okay, but what are you trying to tell me? Why are you being weird? Yeah. Um, <laughs> am I on the radio? Okay, you're acting really weird. I gotta go. So what I heard you say was that you love me and you miss me and you can't wait to see me. I gotta go. Well, it was really wonderful hearing your beautiful voice. <laughs> what do you want for your birthday? Yeah, what do you want for your birthday? <laughs> I got a wrist and a... You want a surfboard? What kind of a surfboard? <laughs> uh, I got a 678. Yeah, well, I'm going to a great place to buy a surfboard. I know the guy personally. He'll give, you, he'll give us a really great deal. How about that? Hey, guys. Hi, Okay, well, I'm so happy you, you called. And <laughs> you called. we're shopping. <laughs> Woohoo! Shopping. Okay. Bye. I'm going to call my boyfriend. Hey! What's wrong with your mouth? What do you mean? <laughs> For real, like, what? Are you, are you sedating or I hope you have a good day. How fucked up are you at? <laughs> I'm not fucked up. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like I can hear little giggles in the background. There's no giggles. It's just me and There's you. There's no giggles. It's <laughs> It's me and you in the universe around us. Just some uh, radio waves in between us. It's keeping us apart. Just know that I love you and I miss you. I'm not saying that. You know I mean? So my boyfriend thinks I'm on drugs. Oh, now he's FaceTiming me. <laughs> love you. Peace. Peace. Peace out, then. I'll call my sister next. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Nothing. Going? Good, how are you? Oh man, it has been a week. How are you at it? What's going on? Are you drunk? No. Are you sure? Yeah, what? Can you give me the 
have like a bunch of gauze in your mouth or something. I sound like I have gauze right now. <laughs> you sound really weird. Is it your phone? I don't know. Okay, never mind. What's going on, dude? No, I'm kind of confused because I was supposed to go to the studio today. And I'm kind of... The studio today? The what? Studio? The studio? Studio? What? Studio? I literally cannot understand you at all. Studio? Sarah, what are you saying? Studio? Am I like on a prank video or something? You think I do prank videos? I, I don't know, Sarah. And it's Anna now? And I'm sitting inside? I cannot understand you at all. This is not like a good prank. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> you just got pranked. Sarah, that was the weird. I thought you were on <laughs> This is what our YouTube content has come to. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Five viewers at home. <laughs> Like, I knew it when I did it, I loved it when I left him. <laughs> I knew I had to tell him. Let no, 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 no. She rocking cigarettes. <laughs> Red lyrics with a little intellect. And all the hard things saying he was into it. Just that I'm not in your head, yeah. <laughs> It's not in your business. So yeah. Sorry that was absurd. Sorry that I'm the way that I am. I'm accepting it. Call or text your parents. Later, guys. I'm sorry, baby.